This is the Artistic Vampire, and welcome to Would You Rather. Now, I'm gonna be honest. I recorded this before, but I forgot to turn my microphone on, and I feel so bad because there was a lot of good questions, a lot of good discussions about myself and and how how uh, friendship works and everything like that. I'm sorry. Um, let me know if you would like me to post that in kind of like a speed up way so we, I don't know what I'm going to do about that but here we are we're at it again I figured I will still record it because I I mean there's still a possibility that these topics would still come up I could bring out the points that I had before or I could we could talk about something new so here we go we got would you rather marry at age 10 or not marry at all to marry at age 10 would be weird but given how kids are it wouldn't be it, it might be like a friendship thing it depends on if it's an arranged marriage or um, or if it's chosen I mean cause kids at that age don't want to marry they don't know what marriage really entails but Given that I am a romantic at heart, I love romance, I love all that sappy shit, I'm gonna go with Mary at age 10. Don't judge me. A lot of people agree. Okay, good. Moving on. Eat the same thing three meals a day for the rest of your life, or eat whatever you want but have to eat a poop sandwich once a month. Well, honestly, my diet is not very varied anyway. Not very varied. Very varied, very varied. <laughs> I don't have a varied diet, so I'm just gonna go ahead and choose this one. Cause why would you ever want to eat a poop sandwich? Okay, moving on. Sun your hand on top of a thumbtack with a half-inch pin, or shoot yourself in the top of the foot with a nail gun. Who is making these? Would you rather's? Um. It does say slam, so that means I can't be like, you know, and just kind of punch it. I think the tack would cause less, less damage. It will hurt like hell, but it won't cause as much damage. And it will probably will not as hurt. A little bit, it probably won't hurt as more, uh, much as the nail gun and the nail going into your gun or into your foot <laughs> it won't hurt as much as the nail in your foot is what I'm trying to say so I'm gonna go with slam your hand on attack and we're just gonna move on past that disaster okay would you rather find out that you swallowed a spider in your sleep or find out that your waiter has spit in your meal um Well, I mean, if I swallowed a spider, especially if it's a poisonous spider, I'm going to die. Uh, if a waiter spit my food, I would just hope that he doesn't have any kind of disease. Um, I mean, I hate the, the thought of... Like, when I see people spit or I see saliva on, on the floor, it does kind of make me gag. And, I, in fact, I kind of have a slight gag in the back of my throat right now. But, um... Overall, I mean, which one is more hazardous to your life? Probably the spider. Even though more people would swallow a spider. People. Would you rather natural childbirth? Burr, burr, burr. Urgh, I swear. <laughs> I, I just cannot talk today. This is just not... Not good. It's not good. Not good. Brownie points for those who know what that movie is. Anyway. Would I rather have natural childbirth or have an epidural? The thing is, I don't really know what an epidural is. So I'm going to childbirth. So we're going to go with that. <laughs> Alright. Would you rather eat your favorite DVD in 20 minutes or eat 100 tissues in 20 minutes? This is stupid. That's a stupid question. Would you rather... Oh, okay, this one's a good one. This one has to do with um, video games, which is something I enjoy. 
and that I plan to play a lot of in this channel. Now, those who watch my Portal series know that I am not good at Portal. Uh, so, I, you, you would probably think I would choose Black Mesa, but the thing is, I have not really played the, those games all that much. I even forgot the name of them. Everyone is kidding me. Half-Life. I, <laughs> I saved myself. Half-Life. I haven't played that much of Half-Life 1 or 2, so... Uh, from from what I've seen, Black Mesa is actually kind of more dark and just ugly overall. So I would probably choose Aperture Science, despite my inability to solve the puzzles. Uh, maybe maybe I get can can yeah, maybe I can become a turret or something and and be adorable. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how it works. But I'm gonna choose Aperture Science. Maybe Black Mesa. That was a joke. Ha ha. Fat chance. Anyway, we're gonna move on. Would you rather drive 20 miles well over the legal drunken limit or drive 20 miles after being awake for 72 hours straight? Honestly, both are very irresponsible. But I feel like the more irresponsible decision is to drive drunk. That is so stupid because I mean some people some people can stay awake a long time. I can actually stay awake for a pretty damn long time. 72 hours straight I don't know if I could do it. Um, even if so I think it doesn't say that you have to to drive that without taking. Oh, it actually, does it says straight. However, drive two hundred miles well over the legal drunken limit does not say that I have to do it like two hundred miles straight. So I could probably pull over. Thing is, would drunk me do that? I have a feeling drunk me would be a pretty responsible drunk. I have a feel. You know what? Despite what I said about which one is more irresponsible, I'm gonna go with the drunk because there's ah. Oh, now I look like an asshole. Don't drink or drive, kids. <laughs> Moving on. Dress only in styles famous 15 years ago, or dress only the way you did when you were 15. Now, when I was 15, I was a goth. I had the dark clothes, I had the trench coat, the long dark hair. I was a goth. And I still kind of like dressing like that from time to time. So, I mean, I don't even know what the famous style was 15 years ago. Let's see, it's 2016 now. So, would that be 2001? Yeah, yeah, that'd be 2001. Wait a minute, I need to do the math. Okay, I'm back. So, basically, dress when I was 15, or dress when I was 9. From what I remember, my style was when I was 9. It wasn't even a style. So I am going to choose dress when I did, uh, dress like I did when I was 15. Because, uh... At least I had some kind of look to me. So we're going to go with that. Alright, watch Batman 1989 or watch The Dark Knight 2008. Watch Batman. 19 oh, really? So many Dark Knight fans. Like, I get it. I get it. Heath Ledger's Joker is awesome. You want to know how I got these scars. You know, it, it, it it's a good... But overall, the better Batman is in the 1989 series so or uh, 1989 oh wait or is that wait a minute 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 that's the one with adam west right fuck well that that's still awesome because adam they call me adam we it's awesome so fuck it always have fingernails five inches or longer have a snorkel on your face permanently
It's normal. There's always, I mean, I can always go underwater. Sure, I wouldn't be able to really kiss effectively. But I can exp explore the waters. Oh my goodness, really? You're gonna ask this? Would you rather work at McDonald's or work at Burger King? I worked at Burger King. It sucked ass, but I think that's mainly due to who I had as a boss. Um, but I don't know. I don't know if McDonald's is any better. I'm just gonna skip that one. I'm just gonna skip that one. All right. If you if you were a TV executive, would you would you would you rather they they worded this excellently. Uh, excellently, I cannot talk. I'm so sorry for this episode. <sighs> Would you rather resurrect your favorite canceled show of all time for one season or cancel your most hated show? I am not one to cancel a show just because I disagree with it, just because I don't like it. I know many other people will like it, so I'm not going to take that joy from them. Instead, I would like to bring my joy back and maybe bring joy back for others and wow this one's 50 50 that's amazing there is more people though who agree with resurrecting a show which is good good people anyway would you rather live in a foreign city and not know the language or live on an island alone uh i feel like i mean it like live in the foreign city and not know the language until what point I could learn the language by living in that foreign city. There's nothing saying that I could not learn that language. So I'd rather choose that one. Alright, and I think this will be the last question. Let's go ahead and do it. Boom. If you had a mutation of your choice, have an extra... Would you rather? Limb or eyeball? I think I would rather have an extra eyeball and I want it to be right here so I could solar flare like Tien. I know. I know. We've been out. We've been out. Oh my god. He's did this and, and talking about Dragon Ball Z. Shut up. Tien is actually one of my favorite characters, fun fact. Um, I don't know, just his look, his stance, his posture, how he handled himself, and that scene where he held down Cell. Sure, he didn't damage Cell. He didn't defeat Cell. He wasn't even close to doing that, but he held him down. Think about the power that took. Okay? Think about how outclass he was at that point and yet he was able to hold Cell down. Sing it for himself. He was able to hold him down. That is amazing. But anyway, that's a whole other topic for another time. I'm going to choose an extra eyeball so I could be like Tien. I would like to know your answers to that question. Would you have, have a rather would you would you have a, an extra limb or an extra eyeball? Let me know down in the comments below. And uh, this is another thing I brought up in the failed recording of this. Uh, uh, I normally don't say it in my other videos, mainly because I don't want to make it seem like that's all I care about is views and subscribers. But uh, I think it does need to be said because it does help the channel. If you like this video, please like it subscribe and hopefully I will be able to keep you here and, and entertain you with my content um, and also please like like I said comment answer any of the questions that I was presented with in this episode of would you rather I would like to know what you guys would have chose and what side you you guys were on so enough rambling enough messing up words this is the artistic vampire and have a nice day